Hello everyone, Multi here, and today we will be doing another Carrier Landings video. Um, what we're going to be doing in this video is, of course, flying the FA-18 Super Hornet. Um, and we're going to be doing Career Mode and the first mission uh, for the island scenario, and that would be Fly to the Airbase. Um, pretty generic title for a uh, islands or for any scenario really, but it is the first of many, so we're going to give it a go. For this series, I'll be doing something a little different. Um, I'd like your input on it, uh, my viewers. Um, what do you think of me doing a video for each of the missions? So rather than having to search up, you know, mission three, one through three, and then find mission three if that's the one you're having problems with, you can just go directly to the one video dedicated to the one mission. Um, I don't know what you guys think. Let me know if you like the short idea of a shorter video or a longer one. Um, but we're going to be doing just this video for just this mission. It is necessary to install recording devices on your aircraft in order to monitor some geographical areas. Take off, follow red 2, and bring the plane to the ground base for installation. So basically, um, our ED2, or red 2 is how I'll call him, and we're going to follow him as closely as we possibly can. That's the goal, is to follow him and then land as fast as we can. And um, we're going to try to land before three, uh, 3 minutes. I almost did it, I've yet to do it yet, but we're going to see if we can do it this time. Weather is clear, 2 o'clock, or sorry, not 2, 4 uh, p.m., sky clear, and zero knots. So we're going to start. Of course, we're going to do complete controls for the plane, um, and we're going to full throttle it and hit that button as fast as we can. Taking off, gear up, and here we had him pass us real fast. But basically, the idea is stay in sync with him perfectly, so, and that's what we're going to do. There's some videos in which we'll look around the cockpit, and I've already tried doing that for this video multiple times. This is like the fifth time I've recorded it. And obviously, I'm gonna do it again, because I'm me. Look at our awesome cockpit. Um, nice radiator, radar, yeah, uh, everything else, all that stuff, you know. Um, I really am just focusing on staying with this guy. Not at all focusing on anything else, except for how much I really 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 want to pull that lever can't do it though unfortunately in the game maybe someday you'll be able to all right we're gonna go back out of this view and for those of you who don't know i'm of course on a windows pc okay all right we're gonna follow him directly we're not gonna use the um other controls uh we're not gonna use our what do you call it rudders for right now because right now we're just trying to stay as close to him as possible and the most um, efficient way of doing that is, of course, using our keyboard controls to uh, stay as close as we can. And um, I know for a fact that you start slowing down. Well, we'll get that to that later. I apologize. I'm getting a little bit ahead of myself. Um, as of right now, we're just going to follow as closely behind again as we possibly can to this guy, R82. I'm going to go back out to this view here. As you can see, we're approaching this mountain here, and um, on the other side, we will have our our landing airbase. As you can see, we're still increasing in speed, which is absolutely insane. I don't know why he doesn't have his afterburners on, and he's still going faster than us. Alright, now we got to start directing ourselves to the airport, see how fast we can get there, and land. So once we get to about three miles, we're going to boom, boom start slowing down as fast as we possibly can okay we got to be under 300 300 knots i think to safely land yep 300 okay and we're gonna get our tushies on the ground before and stopped before three minutes so air brake coming down coming down really hot and boom down that was pretty hard. We're going to full speed the air brake. Flaps I forgot to put down. Always important. I apologize for forgetting to put the flaps down, but we have done it. We stopped the plane and even without flaps. Everybody, ladies and gentlemen, we completed the mission with, um, of course, three minutes. Before three minutes, two minutes, 56 seconds, and that was without flaps. Now, um, for that mission, I actually did something that was sort of right uh, as you can see we'll watch the replay um that looks really cool actually uh though it 
might be a long replay. Let's uh, increase to here. Okay, so as you can see, oh, let's go to this view here. As you can see, I put my flaps down at the very last possible moment. Uh, you should probably put flaps down right about there. The idea is to stop your plane um, or start slowing it down at the least, um, at the at the latest amount of time possible. That is a fast landing for a plane. So you are able to, uh, so you don't start make like take more time. Basically, the later you open your flaps, the later you put your air brake down, the more time that you're going fast, and therefore you can get to your destination quicker. Thank you for watching. Hope you enjoyed this video and hope it helps. Let me know if you've got any questions, and I will do my best to respond and knowledgeably in the comments. And I will see you guys next time. And we are now Petty Officer 3rd Class. I don't know what petty means, but it doesn't sound great. Hmm. Bye, everyone.